guys, this is Kara from Kara's Quest. We're on a quest to go through um, different music albums. Currently we're going through NF's Moments album and today we're going to do NF Overdose. Okay, immediately I know like overdose is like you're overdosing on drugs or whatever. There can be so many metaphors for this. Is he going to be talking about his mom overdosing? I didn't think he went super in depth about his mom in the first album, but let's just try and see. Yeah. I'm looking for that overdose. <laughs> yeah. When I say I want that overdose, it ain't about the drugs. I'm talking about the Holy Ghost running through my blood. I'm looking for that overflow, something I can love. You think the show's over? Oh no, it's just begun. Can... Alright. First of all, his mom at this point has already overdosed just in the timeline of his life, as far as I know. So it's surprising that he's open to using this as a terminology. However, if you do get to the point where like you're so inspired um, to be with God, the Holy Spirit, like, um, you know, God the Father, Jesus, the Holy Spirit, and wanting to be overdosed, basically like come over entirely by him or by the Holy Spirit. Um, yeah, that does make sense. It's, it's, thumbs up to him for um getting past that connotation with his mom and going to this point but okay and i like the rhythm i like the beat there's definitely the moments album like flavor um but i like that it's maybe not as like sad as some of the last songs i listened to by him okay yeah, it's nice to meet you, but my name is not what I came to teach you. Yo, I know a guy who can save and won't leave you. He don't show his face, what well, he don't really need to. I give him the glory for everything I have. He's more than just a story, it's something of the past. I ain't afraid to talk about it, I ain't afraid to ask it. I'm just being me, man, I don't need to mask. You want to buy the face like living for the money. He is just talking about God. He's just going straight on it, um, and let's commend him on that. He's being honest, he is being committed, and yeah, this didn't really get him a lot of, like, popularity and stuff versus compared to his new music, um, but it's truth. Like, if you're looking for God, there's a lot of churches out there that can help, or message me on Instagram, and I can tell you, like, YouTube channels that are good, like, if I know some people it's hard to go to church, like they have negative um, situations or connotations from the past. But here's the deal, if you've ever been hurt by a church that is terrible, really sorry about that, um, but don't let the church's reputation or the church's church itself get in the way of your relationship with God. That's giving the church who hurt you more power than connecting with God who's not going to be hurting you. Um, and so definitely trying to come back from that. Wow, the last video I talked about was not this deep. Um, but yeah, totally message me if you have any questions. People act like rap tight gunny. Running from the cops, see me, that's nothing. But according to you, yeah, that might mean something. That's why I give it to you in the phone you understand. Because sometimes in life things never go as planned. And sometimes your mind. got this other lady singing and there's another lady in an earlier song I did who was singing and I didn't recognize her and maybe it's the same one and I really like that electric guitar just like the rhythm the low rhythm section on the uh, eighth note wait wait each beat quarter notes or like every four notes anyways um, I, I that sounds really cool Overflow. Crazy, the babies, murders in the 
in the streets, murders in the schools. If God really cared, he wouldn't let the pain pursue. But a lot of y'all are looking from the wrong angle. And no one don't sit there, your whole life tangled. You look so he's saying, a lot of people are saying, why is all this bad stuff happening if God is there? Um, and he then he's saying, y'all are looking at from a wrong angle. Um, basically, sin is in the world because Adam and Eve sinned, um, didn't follow God. And God allows that because we have free will. <laughs> now, if there are any Christians out there that want to have a argument or a debate on free will versus predestination. Yeah, I'm not getting into that entirely, and I don't know 100% all about that. I might be incorrect. However, he gives us that freedom, and if he just um, took away our decisions, we'd be mindless robots, and we wouldn't have those decisions. And we wouldn't be made in the image of God, and the image of God is that we have that intelligence to make those decisions. And so if, if we didn't have that decision, um, we wouldn't be in the image of God, and then because we have the decision, a lot of people make bad decisions, and there's terrible stuff in the world. Um, might not answer everyone's questions, but we need to get through this deep song. Anyways, we're only halfway through. Okay, I'm going to try to stop talking so much. Bible leader Satan was an angel. And just goes to show us the Bible would create you. And there's something crazy. And there's something pitiful. You don't want the truth. Now you're leaning like a broken heart. And you looking for the same thing that tore you apart. an anthem okay it reminds me of the newsboys song we believe um and they list all the things they believe but he's like saying i worship a god who made you know created the world and what did he say in six days or something and just like he lists the things that he the type of god he worships not type of god like there's you get to choose what type but i mean he's describing it um so he's being very like specific and devout on it this might be one of his most religious -y songs, but it's it's deep, like it has good hard hitting stuff. Like I I'm liking it a lot for the album. like that one a lot like there was just as much deep content in this song as in his future albums um like the songs in his future albums however those songs in the future albums tend to be a little more a little more on mental health and maybe like um the storyline you know how nf kind of has a storyline to his life and music um but this was definitely like deep more in like spiritual matters and beliefs um, with definitely a moments album sound and I liked it a lot. So, um, good check mark off on our quest. So questers, please go out and have a good quest today. Um, if you haven't need any help or suggestions and stuff about God, you can totally DM me on Instagram. My info is below and have a great day guys. Bye. Today, we're going to talk about how to start a reaction channel in 2020. So you got to know what you want to do for a channel. And let's say you want to do a reaction channel, okay? So is it music? Is it videos? Like, like trailers or movies? Now, you actually do have to start the channel. So get a YouTube channel. Be expressive. Obviously, be yourself.